Oh my world, this is a real unbe the unbelievable issue, you know, bomb chair going on here right now. Do you know that the All Progressive Congress, you can, you, you're free to use the word, deceived David Umayi into their party. And guess what? He thought that um, he would become a, a president. That's what they told him. They said, from your region, nobody has been president. And so we're going to ensure that someone from your region become the president of the country. The guy believed them, you see. And the time came, he saw that um, there was no chance at all. He saw it. He saw that there was no chance. And so he ought to take the, uh, you know, Senate, senatorial form. Guess what? The guy has lost out in everything. He can't become a senator. No, no senator. He's not becoming a senator. He has lost out in becoming the president. And this is the same person who said he was going to ensure that Peter Obi is not voted in. He also said the vote in, you know, in a boy state who belongs to uh, Tinubu. And people in the South East replied him by saying, uh, you mean your votes because you can't speak for the people for the fact that you are a governor does not make you the general superintendent you cannot uh, speak for everybody you see let's get all the details my dear game over david umaye not recognized as apc senatorial candidates court rules he loses on every side the Federal High Court sitting in Abakaleke, Ebony State, the capital, has dismissed a suit filed by David Umayi, governor of the state, asking the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, to recognize him as a senatorial candidate. In its ruling on Friday, the court recognized Anne Agomi Eze, who came second in the May 28th senatorial primary for Ebony South, which was conducted by the all or Progressive Congress as the senatorial candidates. According to Lead Nigeria, the court, however, ordered INEC to conduct fresh primaries within 14 days for the district. David Omai had, through his counsel, Roy Ewozi, filed a suit against INEC at the Federal High Court, asking the court to compare the commission to recognize him as the senatorial candidate for the district. Austin Umahia, brother to the governor, was declared winner of the APC senatorial ticket for a boy south. According to Lute Nigeria, another primary was held on June the 9th, during which Austin withdrew from the Eboi governor for the Eboi governor, reportedly contest, contested, unopposed, and won. However, Although the APC had listed David Umayi as a senatorial candidate for a boy in North, he was excluded when INEC published the list of the candidates for the 2023 elections. The Ebony state governor was a presidential candidate on the APC platform at the time his brother won the senatorial primaries. He, however, lost the presidential tickets. At the court sitting on Friday, Fatu Ramia, the presiding judge, said David Umayi was not an aspirant and could not have participated in the primaries. You cannot have two tickets. Ramio said, according to section 115 of the Electoral Act 2022, the governor neither pro pro procured form nor participated in the primary and as such cannot claim any rights based on the sanitarian primary. Speaking on the development, Unyo Eze, counsel to Agoni Eze, expressed satisfaction over the judgment. Yes, the court has ordered APC to conduct fresh primaries to reap the candidacy of the client and a gozi who took the second position as governor's younger brother has withdrawn now she has to be the candidate the court has given 14 days from friday to conduct a fresh primary for the zone efforts to get the reaction of david dumai's counsel we are unsuccessful have you heard of the word called greed have you ever heard of that word is a very very slippery word where you are not contented now david dumai's younger brother participated in that election and won but you know what he did family friends and family say ah, ah, step down for your brother i don't know this is just me trying to make up a story how dare you you don't know your brother has been there you don't know he has been a governor let him become a senator now and probably he can open up this family oh yeah oh yeah step down step down and the brother stepped down thinking that his brother who is a governor will all of a sudden 
mm, we miraculously become the president, the the, uh, the Senate uh, candidates. Well, INEX said, you didn't buy a form. And even if you bought the form, you cannot buy both presidential and senatorial form. Excuse me, uh, no chance. Since your brother withdraw and the lady who came second, you know, their contention, let INEC conduct a fresh primaries altogether. My dear, as we speak in a Boeing state, fresh primary will be conducted. And guess what? David Umayi and his brother cannot participate. So they have lost on both ends. This was a man who was in the People Democratic Party. And guess what? What happened to him? He woke up one morning. Some persons have met him and said, bro, you can actually become the president. From the East, nobody has been president. Why not join APC? PDP has not given you that opportunity. And guess what? Along came the swinging and the guy jumped on the train. And today, he has lost on every side. He cannot become a senator. He has, he has spent out his two years that PDP gave him to become a governor. When we say that indeed, you know, they, by their fruits, you will know them. And, you know, at last, you think nobody can fight you. You will use your own hands to fight yourself. Is what is happening. David Umayi will not become a senator his brother cannot become a senator at least one person for the family forget him now abi not be so nah man not be so but the guy now nah, they don't lose on every side the matter now nah, he don't tie rapper none of them forget anything now so the matter just be oh now so the matter be david now nah, don't lose a brother don't lose um apc you don't i mean the whole thing is just one key you know it's no longer business as usual well my wonderful people this is what happened when those that should pay attention and ensure that the right things are done disregard the the poets of honor honor it's not it's it, you don't buy it you earn it you don't buy it you don't tell people to honor you you just earn it and so these are some of the things that are going on that everybody needs to really pay attention to. These are the days upon us. Elections are around the corner and we, can, we will begin to see more and more things unfold. More and more. Get ready. You will hear more story. You will not be smart in my people. They happen. I don't want to say they conduct fresh election. But by conducting this fresh election, yeah, it, uh, uh, the governor and his brother may not start, stand a chance because he wrote a letter to Einek saying that he has willingly withdraw, thinking that by so doing, yeah, uh, his brother cannot get the position. But form selling and buying has ended a long time ago. Eh? It was a long time ago. So, penny wise, pound foolish. At the end of the day, you lost on every side. My brother, now so the matter be you. We go like to hear what you think. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. May you still like us. So share, subscribe, click on the notification button so you go get all our latest news. God bless. Bye for now.